Okay, so I've installed Manjaro on my laptop. Part three, welcome to Manjaro. The Manjaro desktop. Congratulations on installing Manjaro Linux. Once you have logged in, you will be presented with the Manjaro desktop. Add a little bit of music here. All right, once you've logged in, you'll be presented with the Manjaro desktop. The Manjaro Hello Welcome screen will load automatically, and this gives you some useful links to documentation, ways to get help and support from the Manjaro community, and some ways you can get involved with the project. Remember that Manjaro is free, an open source software. It relies on contributions from its user and developer community. So in this picture here is the Manjaro XFC desktop with the Manjaro Hello screen. I've got the KDE desktop. If you don't want the welcome screen to load each time you log in, just set the launch at start option off at the bottom right of the window. Don't worry, you can always find it again in the applications menu. Let's now take a look at your new operating system. Okay, so right here there's a thing to click to slide it over to stop it from launching. Um, I don't know where the applications menu is yet. I just set it up. All right, let's now take a look at your new operating system. A notification area can be found on the top right where system messages are displayed. See what's playing. All right, the Manjaro XFCE desktop. So icons, the applications menu and KDE is in the same lower left-hand corner. Uh, Windows buttons, workspaces, system indicators are the same in the KDE desktop. All right, at the top left are the icons currently displayed on the desktop. At the bottom left is the applications menu where installed applications can be found and launched. Next to it are buttons of open windows. A workspace switcher is then located to the right. Workspaces are desktops placed next to each other. Then various system indicators such as battery power, updates, internet connection, and volume can be found. Finally, at the bottom right are a clock with a calendar as well as a shutdown button. That, I noticed you can right click on the screen also if you want to shut down. Um, the applications menu is the easiest way of starting the software programs that are installed on your Manjaro system. The icon for this is at the bottom left corner of the screen. Go ahead and click on it now. You can see that the five main software applications have an item in the favorites menu. This allows rapid access to software you most often use. To add or remove an item from the favorites menu, just right click on it and select the option you want. You can also press the Windows or Super key on your keyboard. Handy. Three, software applications that are installed will be displayed in the Applications menu. For now, let's look in turn at these five applications to give an idea of what awaits you. Let's see, for Add to Favorites, 
five removed from favorites. Okay. Terminal emulator, six, or terminal, allows you to perform text-based commands. Although it initially seems unfriendly, it is incredibly powerful and allows access to commands that are difficult to accomplish with a graphical interface. In this example, I have listed ls the files in my home directory. Learning how to use the terminal is not needed for running Manjaro. It's highly recommended, however. Check out sites like linuxcommand.org. It's good to know how to use the terminal in most Linux systems. File Manager. File Manager is a graphical interface for managing your documents and directories. Most file managers work in a similar way. If you've used another, you can use this one. Web Browser. Web Browser allows you to visit and view web pages so you can read news stories, check the weather forecast, and all the rest. If you have a particular preference for a browser that is not installed by default, you can easily add another one as shown in section Installing New Software. Mail Reader. Mail Reader allows you to read and send email. You will have to add your email account when you first run the application, in a similar way to all mail readers. But once that is set up, you should be good to go. As with the web browser, there are a range of choices for mail reader. For example, if you prefer Claws, Silfeed, or Evolution, you can install it. I see they have a picture of Thunderbird, which I believe comes bundled with the Ubuntu system also. By the way, I'm moving from Ubuntu to um, Manjaro. Add Remove Software. The package manager allows you to search for, install, and remove software applications. In this example, I have searched for the Chromium web browser and I'm about to install it. Once I'm happy with my selections, I can click on Apply to continue. There are two main software managers in Manjaro. PayMac, installed with the XFCE edition and Octopi, installed with the KDE edition. Installation of new software is covered in details in section Installing New Software. I think they mean to say in detail rather than details plural. And here's a picture where they're searching Chromium. All right, getting help. There are a variety of ways to get help and support about Manjaro, as well as finding out more about the project. You can just browse or register if you want to get involved. By the way, playing right now is Hope by Marcus D. Okay, getting help. Remember that Manjaro is run by its community. Without a community, there would be no Manjaro. Whichever method you use, we look forward to meeting you. Manjaro Hello Screen has links to some excellent resources. It's well worth taking the time to have a look at each of them. See, this is the start of it all, Troubles and Blues. Okay, let's have a look at the welcome screen. Discussion forum, that's at forum.manjaro.org. So too, the Manjaro discussion forum 
is a great place to find out more about the project. You can connect at any time, leave questions or replies, and come back to them later. IRC channels manjaro.org forward slash IRC dash channel join hashtag Manjaro on irc.freenode.net whether via a web or desktop client and you'll find a very nice bunch of people ready to chat To talk on the IRC channel, you will have to connect first. HexChat, HexChat, which enables you to do so, comes installed in the XFCE edition. So I wonder what comes installed in the uh, other one. German, French, and Russian IRC channels are also available respectively at hash manjaro de, hash manjaro fr, and hash manjaro ru. Mailing list. L at, that's at list.manjaro.org forward slash list info forward slash manjaro general. If you prefer to use email, there are several mailing lists that you can use to stay up to date with announcements and development, as well as ask questions. At the moment though, most people use either the forums or IRC. Wiki, wiki.manjaro.org. The wiki is essentially an online user manual. It has a huge range of information, hints, tips, and instructions on getting the most out of your Manjaro system. If you need to know how to do something, chances are it's on the wiki. Maintaining your system. Changing settings. While the Manjaro desktop comes with a set of defaults, that should work well for most people you might want to change things like the desktop wallpaper and color scheme, or perhaps how your laptop touchpad behaves. XFCE Settings Manager The XFCE desktop is highly customizable. The settings for your user account can be accessed both via the Applications menu and the XFCE Settings Manager. Either way, there's a lot of tweaking you can do. Don't worry, the changes will only affect your user account, not any others you might have added. What's playing here? Reef by Englewood. Manjaro Settings Manager. The Manjaro Settings Manager provides a set of tools for changing lower level settings such as those you set during installation. System-wide languages, keyboard layouts, users, and hardware drivers are all taken care of from here. It is available under Settings in the Applications menu. Adding a printer Note, the Windows decorations displayed in the front section may differ from the ones currently used. It does not affect the methods shown. Manjaro comes with excellent printing support. Most printers are detected automatically, and many others can be configured very easily. I hope so. I had a problem with a brother printer in Ubuntu. Uh, depending, let's see, depending on which edition you are using, you may have to install printing support. 
In that case, install the Manjaro Dash Printer package from PayMac or Octopi. See next sec section. Or from the command line, sudo space pacman. That's P A C M A N space dash S space Manjaro dash printer. One, to check on the available printers, once the package has been installed, find and open print settings in the applications menu. Playing now is Groovin' in Heaven by Evil Needle. Adding a printer to the list requires administrator rights. Click on the unlock button at the top right of the window. You will be prompted for the administrator password. Okay, you can see it in the photo. Three, then click Add to begin configuring a printer. Hey, look, they have a brother printer pictured up here. That's cool. All right, all detected printers will show in the devices list. Select your printer, then s click Forward. If your printer does not show up, it's possible that your printer isn't compatible with Manjaro. Due to the vast number of printers out there, you may need to install drivers manually. Please visit the forum or IRC channel for help. Manjaro will then search for drivers that may be compatible with your printer. If no specific driver is found, do not despair. You will be given the opportunity to select one from a list. If your printer's manufacturer is not listed, you can choose the generic driver. This is the one I chose here. You also have the option to choose a driver from a file or search one again based on your printer model. Once you have made your choice, click forward. You will then have the choice to choose from a driver subcategory to refine your choice. As Manjaro installs your printer, you can change some settings, like its name and location. These provide an easy way of identifying the printer. You will then be asked if you want to print a test page before being redirected to the properties of your printer. The configuration is done. You can click the OK button to close the window. Your printer should now show in printer settings where you can view the print queue and change the printer settings. To change the settings, you will once again need to click the unlock button at the top right of the window. Happy printing. Updating software. Let me see what's playing. S the number seven even by Eric Lau. All right, software. After logging in, you may notice a couple of pop-ups informing you of software updates. This is great. It means your internet connection is working correctly and that there is new software ready and waiting for you. PayMac. PayMac's update manager is available from the system tray at the bottom right corner of the screen. In this screenshot, it has an icon with an exclamation mark indicating there are software updates. An update check is performed automatically, 
All you have to do is click apply and enter your password when prompted and any updates will proceed automatically. P-A-M-A-C. Oh, Octopi. I have, I'm going to be using KDE, so. Octopi is an alternative software manager for Manjaro. It is installed with the OpenBox and KDE editions as it is based on the Qt toolset. It also has a very funky icon. <laughs> Octo oh, is that the Pac-Man down in the corner there? Octopi's update notifier is available from the system tray at the bottom right corner of the screen. In this screenshot, it has a red icon indicating there are software updates. An update check is performed automatically. All you have to do is click yes and any updates will proceed automatically. Three, alternatively, you can load Octopi's full interface. The number at the bottom shows how many updates there are. To show what is available, click on the button with the red icon and the number of updates. To install the updates, click on the arrow next to the button and then click on install. Installing language packs. Um, maybe I'll do that another time. Thank you. 